Cats. My name's Eric. My name's Grace. And, and these, these are your weekly, weekly updates. updates. Thursday the 29th is even, and Friday the 30th is an odd day. This month is National Hispanic Heritage Month, so it's from September 15th to October 15th. Students, check your emails. You receive information from a variety of sources, such as Counseling Administration, ASB, and Class Office. Seniors will nominate for homecoming this week using Google Forms. Uh, for all those students who have been asking for the past couple of weeks, we finally have our sponsor shirts. They are $5, so come get yours before they run out, because they will run out. ASB stickers are $30, and will get you into VHS games for free, and 25% off thing, items in the student store at discounts. Uh, homecoming is coming up, guys, so be ready for that. Uh, the week of homecoming is October 10th to the 14th, and we will have a spirit week for that, so we will announce those spirit days um, sometime soon. Uh, the dance itself is Saturday, October the 15th, and the theme for homecoming is under the sea. The prices for that are a couple ticket is $25, but if you have an ASB sticker, it's 20, and a single ticket is $15, but if you have an ASB sticker, it's 10. Advi advisors are wanted for the class of 2017, Matt Mates, and CSF. Want to take a guest to HOCO? Come by ASB for permission slips. Hey juniors, what's CASP? It's a very important test that you will take at the end of your junior year. CASP fact. Did you know that if you score high enough on the CASP, you do not have to take the C-Best if you want to become a teacher? It's pretty cool. It sounds pretty cool. Uh, class and club information. Uh, seniors, class of 2017, uh, there is a fundraiser for a brown bag cookie fundraiser for you guys to be able to raise money to pay off your granite ticket. Tickets are $68 this year. And we'll be, uh, granite will be May 17th, 2017. And order sheets can be picked up in room 68. The first order will be due October 11th and will be ready to be delivered on October 19th. If you have any questions, see any, any class of 2017 officer or Mrs. Pena in room 68. Mock trial tryouts. The last day for the tryouts will be on Monday, September 26th after school in room 44. That's Miss Newell's room. Guys, so this week on Tuesday, we have a home volleyball game against the Imperial Tigers. And this is a big game. We really want a lot of you guys to go, and we will have a student section set up, so be there to support your Volleyball Wildcats. Chess Club meeting will be on Wednesday, September 26th at lunchtime in room 44, and the Key Club meeting will be on Wednesday this in room 69 at 7.30 a.m. Hula class every... I'm sorry. Hula class every... I'm sorry. No, 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 right? That's fine. Hula class after school every Thursday in room 68, and you... Ukulele class during lunch every Thursday. Powder Cook football game will be Friday, September 30th. This Friday. If any clubs want their meetings to be promoted on social media, DM your posts to the ASB Twitter and or Instagram. We would love to have more information from clubs and classes and staff promoting the positive happenings at UHS. So like I said last week guys, follow us on social media to stay updated as well as same thing on the videos. and. Uh, subscribe to our YouTube account. Have a great week, guys. See you later. Okay, go. Okay, welcome back. Um, so once again, I'm back, and I got the perfect replacement for Mr. Mugia, Mr. Jeff Weiss. Um, so he's going to be joining me today, um, and so we're going to talk about attendance. And once again, before he goes over some perfect attendance rules and procedures, um, I'm just going to say that attendance without attendance um, it will be difficult to learn um, it would be difficult to be on top of your classes on top of your work so you must attend and that's very important not only in school but in life and in, and that has to do with the workplace etc cetera, etc cetera. and I don't think I have to say much more uh, but for those of you who have been attending uh, we have about a hundred over a hundred students right now who have perfect attendance so 
So for those students, good job. So at this point, Mr. Wise can go over just a couple of things. Okay, thank you, Mr. Sanchez. First of all, I'd like to say, you know, it's always been a dream of mine to take <laughs> Ms. Mungia's spot to be next to the great principal, or Mr. Jesse Sanchez. So, um, you know, I my bucket list, I can mark off one thing. I'm, I'm reaching goals here. Um, secondly, let's, let me give a little shout out to uh, Mrs. Dina Tucker and the ASB this year. They're doing a great job. Uh, the weekly updates are awesome. They're doing a great job with spirit. Um, and, uh, you know, keep up the good work uh, throughout the year. You know, as the year gets on, it kind of um, is hard to keep that up, but I know you guys can do it. So back to attendance. Uh, as Mr. Sanchez says right now, currently we have um, over 100 students who have perfect attendance. Um, since we started school, we want to keep that going. So just like last year, uh, we're going to give away some um, incentive and prizes. So our first time window where we're going to do that started when school started and it's going to go until the end of October, which is next month. So if you can keep perfect attendance from when we started school till the end of October, that's going to be our first window for perfect attendance and everybody who does that will get a Johnny's gift certificate. Um, following that, we'll have some other windows for you to do that and if you can keep perfect attendance for each time window we have throughout the year, then at the end of the year, we're going to have some big prizes. Mr. Sanchez is going to dig deep yeah. in his pocketbook and uh, get something really, really good. I'm not sure what it is. You know, my new car. TV, <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> trip, to, trip to Hawaii. I'm not sure, but he's going to, you know, he got a big raise, so he's going <laughs> he's gonna to take that out of his support of that. Just some tips for you guys. Uh, if you have the parent portal, um, use that as a way to check your attendance. We all know that sometimes... Um, you're in class and that teacher make a mistake and they meant to mark um, Johnny but they marked Sally absent by mistake and you know you were there and you can remind that teacher make sure that teacher fixes that we don't want your attendance messed up uh, because it was a mistake so if you don't have parent portal then have your mom or dad um, grandpa grandma aunt and uncle whoever it is call down here to the school with your counselor and get that set up so you can uh, have access to your grades, your attendance, all of that good stuff. Um, um, like I said, the prices or incentives to keep your attendance up, not only is it, you know, studies show that your grades are gonna be up, but we're gonna give away some Johnny's gift certificates, gift certificates to movies, other oh, things. Right. Yes, a movie. um, so, you know, keep working hard, getting up early, um, and getting to school on time. For us, perfect attendance means no absences, and no tardy, so um, you know that doesn't mean if you missed um, for a school-sponsored event, right? Right. right. Just so right. Mm -hmm. if you uh, miss for something school-sponsored, you can still keep your um, perfect attendance. So keep working hard, and um, hopefully in October we still have 100 kids getting uh, whatever it is we have that month, whether it's Johnny's gift certificates or movies. Okay. All right. Thank you. Good job, guys. Okay. <laughs> I'm here. Yeah. All of it? Yeah, I guess so.